A quick video of the newest member to our family, Bebe. So for the first time, we bought a semi-pedigree cat. We usually get shelter cats, but this time um, I really wanted um, something different. And uh, this little guy popped up and he wasn't too expensive, just expensive enough. And he is the mix between a Scottish fold but of course he didn't get the folded ears and a Siamese and his temperament and personality is so outrageously awesome. It, it, I guess this is a somewhat new breed that they're mixing. And uh, originally we had our heart sets on getting one with folded ears, but then we read that often with the Scottish fold cats, the folded with the folded ear comes a, a certain gene that causes arthritis. So that's something to kind of deter you from maybe getting a Scottish fold with folded ears. But I have to tell you, so we've had a lot of kittens and usually when they're really young, they don't have control of their uh, claws and paws and they can uh, you know, be a little too rough or rip you open with their little claws. Not only does this guy have an amazing personality and he's so smart, but so gentle. Even when he's roughhousing, it's like he understands and he's never drawn blood on us yet. Our um our other our old kitten, Butters, he would just rip people open. I mean, he just had no sense about him. I mean, horribly just rip us open with his little claws. But this guy Everything he does is just so gentle and so graceful, baby. And as you can see, if you're looking for a cat that is affectionate, um, he's perfect because he's not super clingy. It's not like he sits on my my lap all of the time. Um, he's about, we got him when he was 12 weeks old. I believe he is 15 weeks old now. And at nighttime, he doesn't really like to cuddle, which is great for me because I don't even like cuddling with my spouse at night. I can't sleep. He goes into his own little space, and he's pretty adventurous, and he's very good with the litter box, and he'll eat anything. He's not picky with his food, but I have to be careful because he's starting to really enjoy human food. He thinks he should eat every time I eat. And uh, I guess uh, the the breed is notorious for getting separation anxiety. So when we first got him, it was a rough five weeks, um, not five weeks, five days in the beginning. But now he's just fine. But hopefully when I have to leave or go on vacation, he's going to be okay. Because he's Mr. Baby. Such a sweetheart. Um, he's a Blue point, I believe that's what they call them. It's when they have this beautiful gray blue color on the face and the ears and on the paws. And uh, it's just a really beautiful cat. Just a real beautiful, see how jelly is? Look at this baby. Yeah, crunch. Yeah, you're mean. You're so rough and tough. 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 Yeah, you're so rough. And you can rub, rub their stomachs, which is really unusual. So if you were thinking of getting a new cat, and you may have seen this mix of the Scottish Fold and the Siamese out there, I say yes. Don't even hesitate. They're incredible.